about life. Okay, I start off with this dear life. I, I'm supposed to actually run through everything, but then since we have no time, I hope you can just understand what this. <laughs> dear life, you will receive a body. You will be presented with lessons. No mistakes, only lessons. A lesson is repeated and until learned. Learning does not end. There is no better than here. There are only mirrors of you. What you make of your life is up to you. Your answers lie inside of you. You will forget all of this at birth. The reason why I'm here is because we humans, we forget. I'm here because I want to remind myself, also to share with you guys, to remind as a reminder that, that if there's going, going to run through a crossroad in the next few months, you do not know where to go or what's going to happen to you. Okay, but just the core principles because I can't go on much further. I think most of you know what this. These are the men. Okay, this is very important, guys. You know why? According to scientific studies, every time a male, uh, you know, we actually give out about two, an average of two hundred million things. Okay, but. But the more important one is out of these 200 million to 500 million things, <laughs> only one, one will be able to enter the egg and become me and who we are today. Only one out of 200 million. Why? Why? Because we are born champions. <laughs> Must remember this. That we are born in here as champions. That she can be arranged on our own choice. I will carry on further. Okay, just a short story of the boy, his bird, and the hermit. Okay. Okay, I know you are excited, but I know Wonder Woman is here, but guys, yeah. Time ago, in a far, far country, there is, there is a boy and his bird. <laughs> and I think you know, there's a hermit. A hermit is someone who lives in the up, in the mountains and all that. A very clever guy. Quite know that this hermit is a very clever, clever man. So he wanted to test the hermit. So what he did, he found out an idea. Okay. He took his bird. <laughs> A real bird. Okay, a real bird. <laughs> a bird that can tweet. Tweet. Oh, okay. okay, guys. Okay, he's, he took his bird, go to the mountains and meet the hermit. When he meet the hermit, you know what he said? He asked the hermit, Mr. Hermit, what's in my hands? So the hermit, you guys, this is real, but yeah, it's just <laughs> He asked the hermit, Mr. Hermit, what's in my hands? And the hermit saw some feathers and all that. He said, it's a bird, young man. Excitedly, he shouted, is it dead or alive? The reason why he asked the hermit is why? Because he wants to challenge the hermit. When the hermit answers yes, the bird is alive, he will squeeze the bird and let it die. <laughs> Okay? But if his answer is no, if his answer is no, he will let, means the bird is dead, he will let the bird go. So he asked, Mr. Hermit, is the bird dead or alive? What do you think the hermit answered? Yes, sir? The answer what? Exactly. He answered, young man, the bird's life is in your hands. Our life is that the same. The life that we go through, the choices that we make, everything is in our hands. It is in our hands. And because we are champions, we have choices, we must make decisions. Especially now that you are going through your A-level side this year. You must make 
a very strong decision now. Okay, the choice is always yours, no one else. People will help you to go forward, to groom, or whatever. But then you make a choice. The choice is always yours. Okay, this is quote by Victor A. Frank from Men's Search for Meaning. Everything can be taken away from a man, but one thing, the last of the human freedoms, to choose one's attitude in any given set of circumstances, to choose one's own way. Okay, it's all about choice. And I didn't, I didn't pass actually. I got an A for economics. <laughs> It was an A level pass. Okay, it was an A level pass. Okay? But seriously, I got a B for Ivan. When you decide on something, you align yourself, you do it, and tell yourself you must do it, you will be able to do it. But you must know what to do, you must find the right people. Very important. You mix with the correct people also. Okay? Friends are friends, study friends are study friends, you must know people who can push you. Okay? Now there are people who can push you, find them, leverage on them to push you. Okay? Very important for now. Okay, another story about the Great Gallery. Anyone knows what's Great Gallery? That's the one in Australia with a lot of corals and all. Okay, guys, there's these stories. On the ferry, I don't know, ferry or what? It's a boat. Okay. Two tourists. They went around and around the great gallery, looking at the corals, snorkeling, and, and all. Okay, then end up, they actually reached back to the place and asked the tour guide. Tour guide? <laughs> Mr. Tour guide. <laughs> why, why are all the corals? In the deep sea where there are cyclones and all the, where they, the water is very rough and all that, why are the corals there more vibrant than the ones in the shore where the water is calm and you see the why? Do you know why? Actually that's nature's way of handling us. When we are put in an environment where it's rough, adversity, when it's tough, that's when we become better people. Okay, I wanted to carry on but I have not much time, let me just close with this before I just... All truly wise thoughts have been taught already thousands of times, but to make them truly ours, we must think them over again honestly until they take firm root in our personal experience. Okay. I have no time left, so I just want to share with you this before I close. Watch my movies. <laughs> so guys, very very important very very important this is the final spin the last few months of what will shape your future although it's nothing now you will think back 20 years from now you think back to today why did I not make the decision to study just for one good time and get my papers and path of career which is very good for me. Don't make the mistake of the what if game. What if I have done that? What if I have done this? Only six months. Don't play that game. Don't make that mistake. Last six months, you better go all out. Do it. Know your mechanism. Know what to do. Find the teachers. Find the correct people. Okay? And make sure at the at the hour when you take your exam, when you leave the exam hall, make sure you feel that no, I've done my best, my best, my best, the limit that I can do. Whatever happens, I've done my part. I did my best. That's very important. Okay, I want to show you my personal experience with them. I have no time. Okay. Okay, those who want, you can email me at. You can visit my website, orlandobloom.com Okay, I thank you guys for listening to me, but I can continue. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.